sede. I feel like it's a bit skew, but um, I don't have my tripod with me. Anyway, hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to If You're New Here. My name is Larato. I hope that you do stay and I hope that you do become a part of the family. <clears throat> guys, today is the 25th of Jan. Um, compliments of the new year to you. I know that I've already said this on my previous vlog. Excuse the noise, guys. I'm at my son's school, so I'm just waiting for, for them to finish. But sorry, guys, I am in the parking lot, so that's why I keep on looking around me. Anyway, I'm not too sure where this vlog is going to take us, but I do know that I'm excited because it's my youngest son's birthday on Sunday, on the 28th of Jan. He shares a birthday with my grand, with my late grandfather, my late maternal grandfather. I'm like, I've got a seven-year-old and a soon-to-be nine-year-old. I'm, I'm really in awe. I, I always thank God. I'm like, Lord... I made reservations for my son's birthday. Sorry, guys. I made reservations for my son's birthday on Sunday. Can't wait. I just want to buy a China Mall and just get a whole lot of cake decorations. And I want to get a lot of cake decorations because I know that my oldest son's birthday is in May. So at least if I get a lot of them, then I'll always have cake decorations. <laughs> It's Friday guys happy Friday and to be honest with you thank God it's Friday I had a very um a very busy week you know what I, I feel like the thing that set off this week that took me off schedule this week was the parents evening on the 23rd on the Tuesday this Tuesday so I feel like that just really messed up with our routine because we came home so late anyway I wanted to show you something so remember I said I wanted to buy cake decorations because it's my son's birthday on Sunday so he's turning seven. Oh my gosh I didn't see this Aww. this one actually broke my older son is turning nine in May, so I decided to buy for him as well for his cake when I do buy him a cake for his birthday. So I got this nine number nine candle and it says happy birthday there, but can you see it's broken here? And then it says happy birthday ribbon and then obviously you put this in the cake. So I'm going to put this on his cake and then obviously with this I'm just going to find a way of decorating them. So basically, yeah, it's the number nine and the number ten, I mean, number seven. So guys, I've literally got a soon-to-be seven-year-old and a soon-to-be nine-year-old. Would you look at God? Okay, so obviously, I thought it's a great idea to buy them both now. So then I don't have to run around by the time Big Brother's birthday comes. Is that I'm trying to grow my hair again. So um, I was asking for suggestions. Um, I feel like this bald hair basically just to give you a bit of context I started having bald hair I started shaving my hair bald in 2020 um so basically I've uh, lately I've just been doing a whole lot of introspection and I'm realizing that that bald hair was coming from a place of um defense mechanism um it was coming from um survival mode and I don't like that for myself you know I'm generally a very soft gentle person and I feel like with my bald head even though I, I looked good and I rocked it um, I felt like for me it was a way of masking all the 
I don't know when I say issues, but all the things that I was going through, let me put it that way, you know, I was just trying to put on a hard exterior. Excuse my language, please, please excuse my language, but I feel like it gave me that resting bitch face, you know, and that was some sort of defense mechanism for me. So I feel like I want to go back to my soft girl era. That is who I am and I love it. And um, I, I feel like I look good in short hair, so... I want to do a bob. I, I just don't like ponytails. I want to do a bob. I think my phone's going to switch off or is it the lighting? Okay, no, it's the weather changing outside. So I just want to maybe have a bob and then I want to see this color flourish because my family has a lot of gray hair. I've got a lot of family members with gray hair, including my mother. And I always tell her, don't dye your hair. I want to see um its potential when it's fully gray and you styled it and we don't need i want to see that side of you i want something that's hydrating i want something that's going to give my hair a glow and i want something that's going to give my hair a shine as well no yeah shine glow i'm looking for that basically hydration and shine shine as in the whole day because i find that in the morning it does shine it looks nice but then by the end of the day it's like dull like this and it doesn't give off that nice hydration um glow that i want shine that i want so please do recommend products down below and living genuinely in my soft girl era and i really want that to show in my appearance you know i want my softness back so yeah so come along with me on this journey um yeah i hope i give you a little because no but i've been tempted so many times to cut it but i'm like no i'm not cutting it this time hey guys welcome to another day of this vlog today is um saturday the 26th of no i'm lying not the 26th the 27th of um jan i've got a few errands to run um so yeah guys so basically what's on the agenda today i need new pillows guys um and then also on the agenda i just need to buy a cake for my son and then for lunch tomorrow i'm looking for a crop top guys i'm looking for a crop top um you know what i've never been a crop top girly but um the short that i want to wear it's a high waist short and i think it comes up to my knees so i don't mind wearing a crop top with it because at least i know the crop top will be tucked in so it's not going to show much so I'm, I'm hoping for a bright maybe neon orange or just plain just a nice bright orange and then i can never have enough accessories i might go past fushini because i want to get some earrings Um, so like I was saying I was looking for a crop top but um, I didn't find a well let me not lie I found a crop top I, I just feel like I'm not a crop top girly or maybe just the one that I found well there were ones in different colors there was one in pink but I wanted specifically in neon orange and 
they didn't have unfortunately so yeah i went to mr price and i got these two um body suits and earrings i forgot where i put the earrings okay but anyway i got these two body suits this i'll wear tomorrow it's a size it's a size small but i'm sure i'll fit in it because it's quite stretchy so the thing is i don't want a medium because i was afraid that medium might be too stretchy and it might be too big over time and then i got this one this one is a medium to small so this was 80 rand it was on sale if you care to know and then this one was 129 and i got these two pillows they were I'll just take out one. There were 219 each. 299, so 220 each. And it's the um, Latex of Touch Standard Pillow. Yeah, so it's these ones if you are interested. And I like these ones because they last very long. And then as I walked out, I realized, well, I bumped into a lamp, guys, for my bedside table so it's this lamp here this lamp was 200 it was on sale so um let me unbox it for you i love it so much it's nice and big so i feel like it's gonna really do on the side on my bedside i just need an extension to connect my lamp to it so anyway it's this don't mind this i bought this from pick and pay because i just wanted to test it and it is working um so yeah like i said i got this for 200 and then this is yeah this is the top i just can't fit it in here because i've already put in the lamp but yeah it's like this how gorgeous is this guys oh i love it anyway guys um let me just come closer yeah please excuse the mess in the background but yeah i am going to clean it up tomorrow because i want to change that lamp and then put in the the new lamp and then i also want to do my bedding tomorrow so i'm thinking tomorrow is our lunch date i want to do weekly foods um tomorrow for the boys lunch boxes and mine and then that will be obviously after the lunch and then i want to come back i hope that i'll come back in time while the lighting is still good do my bed with you but i also want to do it for tiktok because i really enjoy tiktok guys um so i'm not too sure let me see you tomorrow okay guys bye for now now let's talk then <music>
Anyway, guys, this is the bodysuit that I got yesterday. And then this is the short that I was telling you about. Hurry. It's very long. It's a um, high-waisted short. Can you see? So it works very well with this. And yeah, I couldn't do the crop top, guys. I feel like my... I've, I've never been in my crop top era, but I, I looked at the crop top yesterday and yesterday as well. I looked at the crop tops yesterday and I just, I could feel it in my spirit. Sorry. Crop tops are just not for me, girl. Anyway, this is how I look. And I'm wearing my Fushimi sandals. If you can see, I'm wearing those Fushimi sandals. And then I'm going to be carrying this bag, my Fushimi bag. Guys, somebody needs to tell Fushimi that I'm a die-hard um, supporter. Um, yeah, guys, let's go. I'll, I'll see you there, guys. Toodles. I'm going to celebrate my son's birthday. Let me guys get birthday. Hold on. But guys, Lena, it's also my birthday. Seven years, seven years in the gates on two guys. Seven years with by God's grace, come how one would you by God's unmerited favor? I've been doing this. Come at Lanka Pisces in Kawana. So happy birthday to me, too. I've got every right to say happy birthday to me, too. Anyway, let me not take the spotlight off my son, guys. Bye, shop. <laughs> Hey guys, um, 
I think we've come to the end of our vlog. I am so exhausted. I was doing a TikTok video and um, a YouTube video. So yeah, it, it's kind of, not even it's kind of, it's, it's, it, it's time consuming when you do it with one device. But um, yeah, I'm done. I'm happy and I'm exhausted. And did I say how much I like this girly? She looks so good there. Um, anyway, thank you so much guys for watching. If you've watched up until this far, I really enjoyed my day and I'll never stop singing God's praises about look how far the Lord has brought me and look how much further I still have to go. Um, I'm so content. My son's birthday went very well today, nice, relaxed. And, you know, my son's birthday this year came at a point in my life where I'm so content. You know, I'm so content and I'm at so much peace. Like, I, I think I've mentioned this at the beginning of the vlog that things are just working like a well oiled machine. So, yeah, guys, um, thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry if I look. I'm tired, exhausted, because I am, guys. You, I am. So, yeah, the boys are busy bathing. You just need to take them out of the bath and wash off this face beat and get ready for tomorrow and literally, literally jump into bed and call it a night. Um, Guys, let me not ramble too much. Thank you for watching. Please do like the video. Please do share the video. Please do subscribe to the channel if you are not subscribed and if oh, I forgot to do something in my video. Okay, no, I think for TikTok I'll still do it, but for YouTube it's fine. Um it can miss me. <laughs> but yeah, please do share the video, please do subscribe to the channel and please do um comment down below. Um what do you enjoy about this channel? Um, guys, bye. Because if you like, I get around the tough, will manage. Bye, guys. Take care. See you next time.